guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome back for a brand new video so for today's video as you can tell by the title i'm bringing you all a new in restock a bit of everything because this isn't seekers haul you can hear kiki barking downstairs please ignore her she's so gobby but i love it so over the last Oh, I don't even know how long it's been since I've last done a Sisters and Seekers haul. Over the last like, few months or however long it's been, there's been restocks, there's been new releases, new collections. We all know that I can't help myself. I literally can't help myself. I spend so much money on that. It's actually a joke. To be completely honest, a lot of this stuff was gifted to me, but I have also spent a lot of money myself on some of this stuff. I'm not going to like go for it individually, but just so you know, like, a bit of it's gifted, a bit of it's bought myself. But I wouldn't exactly say they're a small business, but they're not like huge. They don't always have loads of stock in. They're literally just ordering off and then it sells out and you have to wait for restocks best way to find out about restocks is on their instagram this really sounds like an ad it's really not i'm just trying to plug you with all my tips and tricks on how to get your hands on some sisters and seekers i have been doing a lot of restocks recently though of the classics like the yoga all the new stuff's been restocked as well but i don't know if it's sold out anyway enough rambling i'm really keep sneezing today thought i'd show you all the new bits that i've picked up i say recently over the last few months and i do have a discount code if you use the code shannon m10 i'll leave it on the screen now you can get 10 percent off the whole website if you want to treat yourself in time for christmas see what's on there see what's in stock i know they're restocking a new hoodie today um i don't actually have that hoodie not gonna buy it just because my tracksuit collection is a bit of a joke like who needs this many tracksuits apparently me but anyway i'm gonna get into the video so i'll link everything down below if it's out of stock the link will still be there but you just won't be able to buy it. So if you do enjoy, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Right, should we start with what I'm wearing? This is from their newest collection. It's called, I think it's Bless This House. It's like the Christmas collection. It was all knitwear. And I'm so torn between two, which is my favourite one. So this is the first one I want to show you. It's got a little sheep on it. Let me just stand up. If you see my pyjama trousers, <laughs> it's Sunday. I'm going to ignore that. It's just this like off-white knitted quarter zip. It's got a little sheep on it there, but very discreetly. I got a size large. I got all of the knitwear in a size large, by the way. Just because when it comes to knitwear, I like it to be like really slouchy, really baggy. I like little wide sleeves. I and mean, obviously if you want to undo the zip, you can do, but I, I like it zipped up. It gives cozy vibes. But the quality of Sisters and Seekers knitwear is unmatched. Like they're not itchy. Not gonna lie, I'm petrified to get makeup all over the collar of this, but it's fine. But yeah, this is from the new collection. It should still be in stock to be fair, but I love this so much. Right, a couple more. From the new collection this one is a very 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 close second favorite the fit of this one is so nice you'll see when it's on it's definitely more like oversized than this one again it's got like the quarter zip little vibe but this one's more of a cream and brown a heavyweight as well so these are heavy and it's got like a wide sleeve like a turn up detail at the end but how nice is this this one really shocked me because i knew i was gonna like it but it's one of them that looks so much better when it's on i think it's just the fit of it for this one literally just made me fall in love with it straight away so yeah we've got this and then again from their newest collection this is so sick. Another one that I didn't think like would be my favourite, but putting it on and styling it. Chef's kiss. My arm is actually aching from holding these up. They're that heavy. This one's a different material though. These ones are like knitted, whereas this one is a knit, but it's like a really soft knit, if you know what I mean. Kind of got like a brushed soft detail over the top. It just says seeker knitwear on the front with this black stripe detail all the way across. And it's got like a little mini V-neck as well, which is cute. Obsessed with this one as well. Sisters and Seekers knitwear gets a big yes from me i love this I do have a lot to get through so i'm gonna go through all of this stuff quite fast because this video would be long and boring otherwise sisters and seekers christmas jumper if you don't have this you're missing out it is so cute look how christmasy it is it's a really ugly christmas jumper but we love an ugly christmas jumper i think they've got an offer on with this as well at the minute like if you buy this you'll get a 10 pound gift card for free if you don't order it you're losing money girl but this i got in a medium do kind of wish i got it in a large but it's still cute still oversized I love her. Right, last piece that I've got from their new collection. Again, a very ugly granddad jumper, but ugly in the best way. Giving Christmassy vibes where it's like burgundy and green. But again, love the fit of this. Really oversized, really slouchy. Little mini v-neck. Even if you just chill in something like this around the house, they're so comfy and so warm. Like, I've actually got this one on out and I'm borderline sweating. If you're into your ugly granddad jumpers, this is the one for you. A little knitted Christmas stocking. How cute is that with all the little button details they have also released dog jumpers as well but obviously my two dogs are big dogs they're not going to fit them but you can get a little stock in or a dog jumper whatever you want okay next should we do the tracksuits get all the tracksuits out of the way because there's quite a few tracksuits that i've got that are new this is the first one i haven't actually wore this out yet does it still have the tag in so i can tell you the name of it this is the ranch wash hoodie and it's like a sort of camo-y print but if you've not tried a sisters and seekers hoodie this is your time if they're in stock I don't know if they are. Quality of them is just a joke. Like when you wear one of these hoodies, you know when the hood just stays up and it's not sagging, it's not thin. It's just, oh, it's the best. It's a really nice thick material. I've got a pocket on the front. I got this in a medium. I get all my hoodies in a medium now. We do have matching joggers in here as well. These, I love the waistline in these. It's like a really thin waistband. 
It's got a drawstring on the inside so you can adjust it to where you need. And they just go down into a wide leg pair of joggers with pockets on. And again, it says scissors and seekers there to match the hoodie. Put wide leg tracksuits are where it's at. They're just my favourite. So this one's going to be a favourite. I know it is. I think this is sold out though. They did restock it, which is when I got it. Probably gone again. I'm not going to lie. But if you sign up for the restocks and stuff, then you can watch this video. Know what you want to get. Check out. To be quick. That is the only thing. You do have to be quick. This is called the Series Emboss Hoodie in Foam. Oh, I've just knocked it on my lipstick what an idiot when i went to the sisters and seekers hq this was like the most popular one that we was packing and i can see why because she's thick yeah again size medium and it just has like this like 3d sort of print on there i don't know how you'd explain that but just a seeker jeans and the matching joggers are pretty much the same style as the last ones where they're little thin waistband with the drawstrings on the inside pockets it says sisters and seekers there and then just goes down into like a wide leg pair of joggers these are sick imagine this with like fresh white air force that is so cool. I love the simplicity of Sisters and Seekers tracksuits. They're just so minimal. Like, that is so me. Rather than having, like, all different designs and stuff over the front, I do just love minimal stuff like this. I also love the fact that their t-shirts have random stuff on. I do have a couple of t-shirts to show you, but... Yeah, for tracksuits, I like minimal vibe. The next one, I said this and I'll say it again. I think this is my favourite tracksuit that Sisters and Seekers have ever, ever done. It's the colour of it. I'm obsessed with this grey colour. I can't remember the exact name of this. It might be the Seeker Jeans hoodie. But I know the colour of it is wolf and this wolf grey colour is just so sick. It just says Seeker Jeans on the front and then at the back it says Brother Jeans, Seeker Jeans and then it just has like the logo there. All the hoodies by the way are fleecy inside so they're so warm and so cosy. And then the joggers, there's no point in me talking through these over and over again because they're literally just the exact same but obviously in the wolf colour. I've wore the hoodie but I haven't wore the whole tracksuit yet so I do need to wear it. Right this next tracksuit I feel like is one that I'm going to have to save till the summer because this colour in this weather, in the mud, no. But it's just this really creamy hoodie. It says Seeker Jeans on the front. This is like an embroidered vibe. I have already wore this. I wore this when I went to Germany with Nivea actually. Um, but I didn't have the joggers then. But the joggers restocked so I bought the joggers. Very dangerous colour to wear. But so is this to be honest. But you know what? Life's too short. Wear the light colours. And then again the exact same joggers. But this is the colour Balm. So exactly the same. Wide leg joggers to go with that one. With some of the tracksuits though there is options to have wide leg or cuffed. But most of mine are wide leg. I have got a couple of cuffed, but the wide leg is where it's at. Right, this last tracksuit that I've got to show you is not a hanger because I wore it yesterday. And I'm going to wear it again today because we're going on a big dog walk with all of Cobra's friends from daycare. I feel like this is an underdog, you know. This tracksuit, I feel like, isn't as popular as it should be. But I am obsessed with this colour. I love wearing a dark charcoal grey. It says Seeker jeans on the front. This is like a toweling material. But I love, like, the dark grey with the... Still dark grey, but a little bit lighter grey. Quality. I have zero words for the quality of these. I just love this. I wore it with this big red puffy coat and it looks so sick. But the joggers for this one are a little bit different. If you see any dirt and then please ignore. But they've got the same waistband with the drawstrings inside. But these ones are cuffed. But I do love the fact these ones are cuffed. I'm like, oh, wide leg, wide leg, wide leg. But I love the fact that these ones are actually cuffed. And the joggers are fleecy inside as well, so we love that. Yeah, I don't know if this is still in stock. I feel like it might not be, so it might not be un unpopular. but Not unpopular, but not as popular as it should be. But I haven't seen that many people with this but this is probably one of my favorites i'm not gonna lie right so that's all for the tracksuits that i've got to show you guys now i've got a new knit to show you this is my favorite knit that sisters and seekers have ever done she is sold out but sign up for the restocks because we all need this in our lives how nice is this i can't remember the name of it though i think it might be the communion hoodie but i will link it down below anyway because the sisters and seekers stuff even if it's out of stock you can still see it on the website so i will link it what makes it my favorite is it just seems like a little bit thicker than the other knits that they've done not really in terms of here like it does a little bit but the hood, like the hood is double layered so it sort of stands up even though it's a knitted hood. It's got like an S embossed there and it's kind of like a checkerboard print all the way over with a pocket. But I just love this so much. I do get all my tracksuits, all my joggers, hoodies in a medium. It's just the knit where I got a large in. But I love this. It's got like a speckled detail all over it. It's just so sick. Next up we've got a couple of t-shirts. I picked this one up in the restock. I've wanted this t-shirt for so, so long. But this is what I mean about the random designs on Sisters and Seekers t-shirts, but why do they just work? Bit of the t-shirts are so cool, like they're a really boxy, oversized fit. I'll get these in the medium as well. It just says serotonin with a goat on the front. Like, what does that even mean? But it looks cool. But I'm so happy to finally have this. I've wanted it for so long. I feel like it's gonna be a love-hate because some people will look at that and be like, why would you want that? And this t-shirt is like a sort of greeny gray color and just says mom's favorite on the front. Probably not true though. You know what mom's like with their sons? He's definitely the favourite, but you know what? I'm still going to wear this. Act like I'm my mum's favourite. I love this. The same boxy fit as the goat one. Maybe not as long as the goat one though, but yeah. Size medium and she's cute. These are perfect for the summer, you know, like with shorts and stuff underneath. 
I live in these in the summer. Next thing I forgot to show you guys is a pair of flares. I've never had a pair of flares from Sisters and Seekers, but these... I can't remember if they were a restock or if they were on the outlet section. I didn't even know Sisters and Seekers had an outlet section until not that long ago. I have ordered something from there, so I'll show you that in a sec. I'm not sure if outlet just means, like, dead stock or if it's, like, stuff that they didn't end up releasing. I don't really know. But these are sick. I think they were on sale, but I can't remember why. It's knit, and they look so good together. They're literally just a flared pair of trousers. The quality's unreal. They're so thick. They kind of feel like the Tyler leggings. These are definitely cheaper than Tyler ones, though. Just a straight waistband at the front and then at the back. It's just got Sisters and Seekers printed in it there these are so nice i wish they did more colors of these actually i think they do i think they've got gray i just don't have the other colors i love these ones i've been looking for a pair of brown trousers like this you know when you get like a brown and it's like a really warm chocolate brown i didn't want that these are like a cool tone brown and these are sick i got these in a size medium and i love them so much these with that jumper and uggs is a vibe right and then the last thing i'm going to show you in this haul because otherwise we're going to be here forever i do have a lot more stuff but You've probably seen it all before anyway, so I thought I'd show you all like, the newish bits that I've got. So I picked up this three-piece set in the outlet. I can't remember how much I paid for it. It's another pair of flares, but instead of like that slinky legging material, they're like a cotton sort of material. I did have to get them in a size large. They are a little bit big. The other sizes were sold out, but again, they're just like a little flare. I love the colour grey that they are. They're kind of like a... I don't really know what kind of grey they are. I love them. I love the material. They're really, really comfy. Even wearing this outfit, just going to do a food shop around the house or something. They don't say Sisters and Seekers on them anywhere. They are just like a literal plain pair of flares and then i got the matching top which is i don't know how you would explain the shape of this top it's just like a normal vest i would say and i got this in a size medium i probably could have got a small in this though to be honest it is a little bit big but it's the same like cotton material it's got loads of stretch to it i love the shape of it and even this with like joggers and stuff would work but the thing that made me buy the whole set was the jacket so it's like a zip up hoodie in the same material where it's like the cottony ribbed stretchy stuff but guess what the inside is? It is fleece. We've got a fleece lined jacket. Is that a joke? I had no questions asked. I was like, add to basket. Again, it doesn't say sisters and seekers anywhere, which I probably would prefer if it said it like printed there or something. But we've got pockets. It's also got these little toggles so you can like tighten it around the waist if you wanted to. A little hood. I just love the fleece on the inside. It's so warm. I have already wore this and I love it. So we've got the jacket in a medium as well. But what a cute little three piece set. Can't really go wrong. Outfit's already put together for you. That's it. That's all the stuff I'm going to show you. If you want a part two, let me know because I've got so much more stuff that I can show you. But obviously, if you want to be notified when they're restocking, you're going to have to follow them on Instagram. I have so many people messaging me saying, when's this restocking? When's this restocking? Like, I don't know. <laughs> Literally find out the same time as you do on Instagram. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up subscribe don't forget to use my code shannon m10 to save yourself 10 percent off the whole sisters and seekers website if you do manage to pick anything up let me know what you get check out the new knitwear the little sheep jumper but yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys very soon with a brand new video Mwah.